get a little generic in his in his diaper. <laughs> Is that a depend, you old man? Hello, survivors, and welcome back to the Escapists. Yes, indeed, my friends. Pablo Punchwood has yet again found his way to another prison, recaptured and incarcerated for the seventh time now. So he has escaped six prisons up till now. The latest being the HMP Iron Gate prison, where he literally had to sail away to escape into the sunset, and he did. And then he caught a plane ticket to Canada to hide away, but something went wrong. It crashed into the Canadian wilderness, and, well, you'll have to watch my The Long Dark series to find out what happened to Pablo and how he ended up here at the new prison, which he is, by the way, on his way there right now in the paddy wagon. So, uh, all right, let's go find out where he is and we have a lovely skin the maru skin which by the way speaking of punchwood skins i have the artwork for the t-shirt guys it's the special punchwood slash survivor slash escapist t-shirt that i've been talking about um over the past few days and i would love to replace this with that because the artwork is fantastic but we can't do it quite yet hopefully soon and i'm going to talk more about that t-shirt here uh, during this series, and it will be available within about a week or so. Um, anywho, let's get to prison. Camp Epsilon is where they are bringing Pablo Punch with this time. It is an open-air prison, all outdoors, surrounded by fences, snipers on towers, no privacy anywhere, gonna be tough. Just the way we like it. Okay, so here we are. We're gonna rename some characters here, guys, because I have some names. And I want to use custom names because I'm kind of getting sick of the same old people. We'll keep the uh, guard names as we have them here, which is perfectly fine. We've got some new ones in here. Shelby, that's new, I think. Jamal, that's new. Leroy. Oh, we got Rory back. Nice. Kino, he's back. Okay. But I want to rename these fellas here. we got a lovely diverse group. Let's go ahead and use some names. And these are people that I know from YouTube. Um, some of them are friends, some just, uh, just play escapists. They all play escapists, but some I know, some I don't know so well. But, uh, you may recognize some of these names. So first, let's go with, um, let's see if we can match some first. Okay, here we go. You might know this guy right here. This is a pal of mine. He's been playing lately. <laughs> Generic B, the hermit. Perfect. Uh, let's see. This looks like somebody you might know too. It's Littlewood. Oh, you may know him as Martin Yogg's cast. He's also playing Escapists. So how many do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, good. I've got ten names. Let's do the friends first. And then we're going to stick uh, people I don't know here at the end. Let's see. Where's a Chimney Swift? Chimney. Uh, let's just put this guy here as Chimney. Chimney Swift is also a Palamine. And Chimney Swift 11. Check him out. Tell you what, I'm going to go ahead and put all the names in, and then I'll meet you guys in the prison, and we'll get started. All right, guys, all the usual suspects now have names. Again, these are YouTubers. Some of them I know, some of them I don't. You may recognize the names, but they all play escapists, so I thought it'd be kind of fun to throw them in here. So here we go. We have Chimney Swift, who is a pal. We got Jack Septic Eye, who plays Sparrow, who is Sparrow's Journey. Uh, Littlewood, Martin Yogscast. Markiplier, Generic B, my pal, the Hermit, Mathis from Mathis Games, um, Jeff Sano from the Minecraft server, and Lucklin, my good buddy, Lucklin FTW for the win. And check them all out, guys. Lots of fun, good people. And here we go. Let's get started. We'll talk to the guards once we get inside. All right, here we are. Camp Epsilon. Hello, Kano. Do you remember me? I think. You were from Shankton State Penitentiary. Hold on. Wasn't he? That name rings a bell. Let's get on over to roll call. Hey, Jim. How you doing, guys? It's been so long. Hey, last time I saw you, Little Wood, it was like at uh, the Mine Con in 2011. You remember that? It's been a long time, bro. Hey. All right. Let's get the shake down. What does it matter? Sparrow and Markiplier. This is kind of fun. So, hold on. Oh, of course. Lachlan, my good pal, is going to give me the first favor. And I can't turn him down. Lucklin says, I've been tailing a thieving rat for days, Pablo, and worked out his routine. Distract the guards at next morning roll call for me so I can check his dash. Hmm, that's tomorrow? Yeah, I can do that. I don't. Ha I have nothing else on my calendar. <laughs> you betcha, pal. All right, so 
we have some things to do as usual. We need to uh, do a few things on day one, and that is, of course, uh, get the lay of the land, learn the schedule, get some easy favors, start choosing some lap dogs, and looking around for some places to hide some contraband, and of course, spend some cash if we see anything that we can afford, because right now we don't have not much money. Oh, but we have a job. Let's check our stats. I'm sure we are weak and stupid and slow, and we're a gardener. Uh, 30, 30, 30. Okay, not too shabby. I think in this prison we might go with kind of a brutish attack, don't you think? Brutish strategy? I haven't been a brute since San, San Pancho, but that worked out really well in kind of an open air. Hey, Jeff said, oh, how's it going, buddy boy? Jim, what do you mean? What do you mean you're busy? Wow, give me the cold. So generic. Wow, what are you so angry about, buddy? I thought we were pals. Okay, you gotta work on that. He's unemployed. But would you get a job, hermit? Okay, so we'll be going. Oh, breakfast is right here. Wow. What do we have here? No, no, please don't tell me. Please don't tell me it's a Krabby Patties. Yes, the chef does need eliminating. This is a Krabby Patty. Yeah, yeah who said that? Stop, stop taunting me. <laughs> Markiplier and his pals jumped me and took my pack of mints. Get it back. Lucklin's got, he's full of jobs. All right, buddy, I can't turn him down. In fact... Uh, I gotta work on, 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 um, who's gonna be my lap dogs? Uh, I mean, I shouldn't call them lap dogs. These are friends. How about, let's get generic be on a good side. Cause he, he seems, he seems angry about something. What's up, buddy? Hmm? <laughs> this is so great. Warden Dean Hall. Wow, the oldest warden around right there. All right. So we, uh, oh boy, we have a lot to do, guys. First thing, like I said, is kind of get the land and figure out the schedule. This is the gardening job. Let's follow the arrow. And, oh, it's a fight already. Here's our gardening stash. And we'll go do some hoeing. Rory! He's a good friend from a long time ago. Now, getting back to these names. That's mine, Mark. Beat it, would you? Go make a YouTube video or something, stinker. Um, yeah, so getting back to um, the t-shirts and everything. Well, look at you. You stop going after my weeds? What's wrong with that guy? He's got a problem. Uh... So, yeah, getting back to the um, the t-shirts and everything and the artwork. So, everything is done. It's just being finalized at the the t-shirt company, which is uh, Teespring. It's going to be running a campaign. It's going to last about, I don't know, seven, ten days or something like that. Um, all the t-shirts the will be offered through my videos. And, oh, let's go through some... Uh, what is that smell, Matt? Let's, well, let's go through some desks here. Punch with this escape. Stalag Oh, my gosh. I'm not a mailman anymore. I can't just walk into people's desks, into their cells. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, sorry. This is all fencing. This is all fencing. There's no privacy. Generic, what can I do for you? Man, you have been working out. I heard you were out in the South Pacific, too. I'm on the lookout for a comb shiv. Dude, I just had one. Where were you? Five minutes ago. That's my desk. Okay, this is going to be tough to get in here. We're going to have to get a job that allows us to get into desks. Whatever that happens to be, guys, we're going to get it. I'm just going to grab a bunch of stuff because stuff is good. No, yeah, you. You're my problem, Mark. I can see Mark's already going to be a problem. I don't even know the guy. I know he plays escapist, but I don't really know him very well. Um, but man, he seems like a problem. Okay, I'm not going to make any contraband right now. There's really nothing to make. And, excuse me! Mr. Jacksepticeye, what are you doing? He seems like a friend. Oh, he's, he's okay. He likes me. Jack, Jackie boy, talk to me. What, what's his job? You're the librarian, aren't you? I plan to teach someone a lesson during next exercise period. Wait, I know Jack Septic guy, and he talks like this. Hello! I plan to teach someone a lesson during the next exercise period. Get the guard's attention so I can do my thing. He's Irish or Scottish or something. I don't know. But that's how he talks. He's just, uh, his, his like, veins are going to pop out of his neck. It scares me. He's going to have a heart attack at, like, 30. All right, yeah, I can do that. I think so. Exercise period. Ooh, that's today. Uh, okay. I need some money. Jeff Sano, what are you selling? I got 25 bucks. Uh, shucks. Man, you are expensive. Jeff. Ooh. All right, we got to work on that, Jeff. All right, let's, let's talk about it. Small talk. Where is my buddy? Um, generic, because I want to give him this thing here. Oh, Chimney. Chimney, what are you, what's your job, Jim? He's working in the mess hall. He's making the Krabby Patties. Chimney, enough of the Krabby Patties. Flush them all down the toilet. Let's go work out, because we're going we're gonna to pound some people in this prison. So let's work out. I think we're going to do kind of the brutish thing in this one. Generic assist. Oh, generics. What's... He's been working out. But he's just gotten a fight. Generic is a goodie bag. Where is he? No, seriously. Oh, man. I missed it. Oh, it's workout period. Okay. 
Okay, let's uh, let's pump it up. Let's get some health going, guys, so we can take a punch. And then we'll work on our speed so we can we can punch faster. And uh, and then we'll start knocking some people around. Littlewood and his pals extorted a magazine off me. Thing is, I want a mag. I will check in his desk. Whoa, Jeff Sano going after who's that? Oh, <laughs> bad move. <laughs> The guard knocked them both on their butts. Oh, generic. That was generic. Wow. The two Minecraft guys going after. Generic, listen. No fighting. Ooh. Ooh. Taking it all, Jeff Sano. No fighting, generic B. All right, so free period. Oh, this is great. Because, see, I'm so used to not having any free periods. So does yours. Just shut it. Um, at the last prison, HMP Iron Gate had, like, one free period and didn't seem to last very long. Remember that? Hey, buddy, comb shoe, remember? Pay up. 18 bucks. Nice. All right, this is good. Drop those. And now, let's get back up. <laughs> Look at little generic it is in his diaper. <laughs> is that a depend, you old man? Oh, boy, that's great. All right, hit some bodies. Get to the floor. Hold on. My desk. I'm going to put everything in here. Uh, we're going to start getting some jobs, hopefully, to give stuff away. And we need contraband. We need... Well, I think here, what we're going to do is go for a weapon and armor. In the last prison, we didn't care about that because we get zapped with those uh, tasers and you would lose everything instantly. But this time, we are going to be after some things. Contraband pouch isn't worth it at all because there's no contraband detectors that I have seen so far. So I'm not going to worry about that. No, get out of here, generic. Get some good stuff, would you? This screws are loose. Two pounds. Um, man, there's so much to do on the first day. We've got to get some smarts going. Sparrow! Somebody knocked out the sparrow. Let's, uh, no fighting, kid. Let's take some jar of ink off him. And Mark, I told Jack Sa Jack's wife, <laughs> I paid Jeff Sano good money for a bottle of sleeping pills. Yeah, let's go check out these desks. Looks like Jeff, Jeff's a kind of a brute in this one, isn't he? He's a bruiser. Um, all right, we got to find these desks here. So let's check Jeff Sano's desk and get Mathis's magazine from in a little wood. Here's, uh, here's Little Wood's desk. Oh my gosh, look at that. Yeah, they see from the with two sides. Holy, this is why we need that new job, guys. I'm going to find out who's in the, in the, oh wait, I already know who it is. Oh, look at this. Ooh, grab it all, grab it all. Not me, not me, sir. Um, Generic B is the librarian, right? Isn't that, isn't that who I saw in there? Which means we're going to have to take him out. Uh, all right, so let's give away the comb shiv. We can use this to make up a, uh. Make up a lot of things when I think an armor. So, yeah, we're going to get a weapon and an armor going right away so we can start pounding on some folks. Jeff Sano. Oh, who's my roomies? My, my next door neighbors, Lucklin and Sparrow. Nice. Here's Jay Sano. Whoa, 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 whoa. Who's the goodie bag? Generic, you are. Man, he's a belligerent little old hermit, isn't he? <laughs> Generic went after somebody with a plastic knife. Oh, you're killing me, kid. No fighting, generic. You know the rules. There, you can have that. Um, we're gonna have to study. There's so much to do. I'm serious. Jack Septic is now fighting. Seems like there's a lot of fights here. All right. Well, uh, we want that magazine, and oh yeah, this is all good stuff. I can't even take your clothes off because I'm full. You can never have too much fun, Lucklin. Uh, little little wood boiling in here. Not as hot as the South Pacific, I'll tell you that much. I'm just going to load up on stuff. Just loading up. We need all of it. And then we'll start crafting up a... Uh, crafting? We will start thinking about... I got all of them, don't I? Yeah. Hey, little wood. Crafting it, bro. Um, we'll start coming up with some ideas as far as... Where and how we want to escape. Or at least think about uh, some short-term plans to get there. Of course, day one isn't really the time to think about that kind of stuff. Uh, nails. I have nails, don't I? I can make a baseball bat. I can give away some stuff here. All right, let's, um, Jeff Sano, what are you, what are you selling? Stop. And have a comb shiv. Mm -hmm. And timber. I need the timber, and it's nice and cheap. Let's grab it. And let's go put that away. Don't need the wire. So now we can, uh, we can start working on... We got a tool handle we can make up. Of course, we may not be smart enough to even make a tool handle right now, but 
we could use this to make a bat of some sort, I think, with the nails. But I think we need duct tape for that. I'm not sure. Let's check. Somebody's fighting. Let's just check here because I haven't made a weapon in a long time. HMP Iron Gate didn't need one, really. There it is. Timber, duct tape, and nails. I was right. So a spiked bat sounds like fun. I think it's like a 3-5. All right, let's get over to uh, the evening meal. Lachlan! Ooh. Ooh. Marks down. Marks down. I'll take that sock mate. Until we saw it. Good. 3-5 weapon right there. All right, let's go. Whoa! Oh my gosh, get out of there. I did not mean to jump over the counter like that. Jack, you better beat it. Or I'll beat you. Soon. Lachlan is plotting something. I can smell it. Go knock him down and remind him who's in charge. <laughs> Generic me! You want me to beat up Lucklin? Uh, I can't do that. He's a pal. I can't. I'm not beating anybody up just yet. I'm gonna have to pass up on that one. I know. I know that makes you angry. But I'll tell you what. I'll make it up. What? I'm right here. Make it up with a comb shiv. Okay. Wow. Thanks. Oh my gosh. I'm right here, dude. I can't even step around the table. Chim. Chim's got wood. Timber's always nice to have, but I'm going to save up for some duct tape. Again, I don't really have a plan yet. I haven't even looked around to see what we can do around here. Next shower block distract. A lot of distractions going on here. I don't, I don't know if I can do it. I don't have anything to lose other than a little bit of cash. Uh, the copay isn't very much. I might as well try. Don't I have another one to do? Distraction at shower block. I thought I had another distraction. Maybe that was... Oh, did I miss it? I think I missed it. All right, well, Oh, I get... What? I got to do the job twice? Get out of here! Leave my hose alone! It's my hose. Thank you, guards. Rory. Where's all the weeds at? I bet that Mark is after him, isn't it? Mark? What the heck? Where's all the weeds? Mathis is going after my weeds now. Good. I like these hard weeds to pull up because they you get uh, a double a double on the quota there. Jeff Sano. Oh, here's one. Holes always lead to adventure. <laughs> he is a Minecrafter. He knows after all. Luckland's breaking out. What was this? I just got here. Why would you want to leave so soon? Luckland? Hey, we did it. All right, stop. No overtime. Let's check the board here. Only three jobs. Oh, Jack Septic is the librarian. No problem. We're going to take him down, boys and girls. We're going to have to disrupt his job. And then... We'll get it. I want that job. That way we'll get access to everybody's cells. We can go through desks without the guard batting an eye. Right, Kino? Right. Oh, no, you can't. Not yet, but you will. After I drop you and turn you into a goodie bag. Mr. Markiplier. Someone took your Shell Teaks poster? Jeff, no! Wait a minute, really? You have one? Can I? Oh, well, I don't have it anymore, I guess. Oh, <laughs> uh -huh. holes always lead to it. Oh. Goodie bags. You guys taking a nap here? We got Lucklin and Little Wood just sleeping on the job. Mathis is framed by... Where are the dang showers? Over in the corners. Here we go. Oh, it's shower block. All right, I'm already here. Hurry it up. I got $84, and we're about to get a few more. Hey, Jack, what's up? Yo, 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 PSJ. It's all cracking off. Next evening meal. If you could distract the guards, I'll see you right. 26 bucks. Okay. Now, I have to do this right now. Shower and block right now for Mathis. I get a few dollars. So, let's get out of here. Let's just see if anybody's selling anything, and then we'll... Uh, Smash somebody. Actually, I don't want to buy anything right now because I gotta run. Uh, all right. So here we gotta whack. We gotta whack somebody. Um, let's let's just whack a guard. Now run. Yeah, run, run. Surrounded and ran. So I, I got a few bucks. I lost a couple. Some people say you lose stats, but I don't think that's true. This is something we'll have to test someday. There was a stash back here. That's a weird, weird spot. Behind the job, it's in the job area. Hey! Uh, glass shard, comb, and pack of playing cards. Playing cards are good to give away. Oh, it's Littlewood! No fighting. LW? 
All right, let's check in. Chimp. Mm, no. Sparrow. Mm, no. What I really need is some duct tape. Can't do anything in prison without duct tape. Oh, by the way, I need Sparrow laid out on the floor. Uh, sure. Listen up. Actually, let's get the shakedowns first. I want to tell you guys about what I'm going to do with the t-shirts and the next season of, uh, of Escapists. So instead of using names of people that I know um, or random names, I'm going to use names of you guys with t-shirts. So I'm going to have a little contest. You're going to wear the t-shirt. You're going to take a selfie. A, uh, ooh, 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 Jeff, nice. Hold on. Let me think about this. Uh... Nah, I can find all that stuff. So you're going to take a selfie, a hashtag C-E-L-L-F-I-E -E of yourself with a t-shirt on and then send it to me or at least put the image somewhere. Send me a link via email or whatever you want to do and uh, then I'll take a look at it and I'm going to pick nine, ten winners, whatever, and then I will use your names, whatever name you want me to use, your Twitter or uh, YouTube profile name, whatever it happens to be as, uh, as prisoners. So I think that'd be kind of fun. Of course, that's not going to happen until the t-shirts the are done, which is going to be, um, like I said, about a week or so. Hello, Officer Rory. I know I'm not getting a shake now. I didn't see those names. I didn't say anything about it. But trust me, I'm not. So can I? Hey, Sparrow. Here, I'll play cards. Nice. I know. I know. And can I reach Lucklin from here? No. Shucks. All right. Well, then I will just give Sparrow here a comb shiv. Yeah. Hey, listen, if we're going to live next to each other, we're going to have to be friends, okay? we just got to get along. And I think that is everything for today, guys. Yeah. All right, well, we got a lot of work to do. Clearly, we've got to work on our intelligence to get that up so we can start making some things. We have to buy all the necessary material to do better things and so forth and so on. You, you guys know the score. And uh, so we'll do it in the next episode. All right. Hope you guys enjoyed this, and once again, keep your ears and eyes tuned to this channel so uh, you can learn about the Escapist t-shirt and um, when it's going to be out and all that. I'll be talking more about it in every episode. The closer we get, it will be available soon. It does look pretty awesome. In fact, I'm sure I have already shown you a shot of it in this video. If not, I'll put it up right now. Ready? Bing! There it is. That's just a sample. It's going to be even awesomer than that when it's completed because they're still tweaking. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. We'll see you next time. And if you did enjoy it, then a thumbs up on the video is always appreciated. And uh, love you guys. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.